Hi, I'm Tony Stefani with Hillside Christmas Tree Farm. I want to take a minute to show you how these little hook things work, but it's a pretty good hole in this tree. And right now we can kind of see distinctive, like nothing from here to here, probably about, uh, you know, two and a half feet off the ground or so. So there's going to be a hole. So we can take these uh, yellow hooks, we can try and pull some stuff down at this age and hopefully leave them over the uh, course of this year. We'll see if they'll uh, fill in this hole, but and pull some of that stuff down, use a couple of them. This hole is actually all the way around the tree. So we'll see how that works. So I don't know if you saw, but there was that big shooter kind of growing up through the tree into here. And we just kind of created a hole. So, yeah, and we'll use one of those yellow hooks. We'll bring one up, bring him down. And we'll fill that hole the right way. So we can see is, uh, definitely more going this way than there is this way so maybe we'll take these two see if we can train them down so with two of these sticks try to spread them out and you hook this onto a branch lower Not like that. So, again, I talked about tree research and pictures. So we saw before in the video. We'll put a tag on it. Get the number in the video. And we'll just nip it, just like we think, so. There it is. Well, that's our video for using those uh, yellow tree trainers. I hope you uh, learned something. I think in Michigan, we're very fortunate to have such a good relationship with Michigan State University and that they uh, brought those to some of the winter meetings and we're actually giving them away. Um, so I grabbed a bag or two and I put them to use. In Europe, I guess it's a pretty common tool along with some other things that kind of uh, are a little bit different here in the U.S., but um, I think they're pretty neat for doing exactly that, of filling holes and kind of creating, save, saving trees. So um, I hope you liked it. hope you subscribe to the channel. And uh, if you got any questions, let me know. I'll keep an eye out for finding that link, and I'll uh, keep you posted. Thanks.